particular uniqueness of Japan is something that's always intrigued me. The politeness and the respect that they show to other people and to their environment. I've occasionally ended up coming here for just one day because that's all I could fit in around other things. To come to Nagoya and enjoy the deep ceramic history here because uh, all of us at Adadome are satire geeks as well. I love coming here. I love the sport, the baseball. I love the food, the clothing and shoes. I like to build Japanese robot models in my spare time, so there's lots of reasons to come here and fill up the suitcase. At Adadomus, we love to tell stories, and one of the best stories that we have is the story of Inax and the story of Japanese ceramics, the beauty and genius of Japanese tiles, and how we go and find product, and how we treat the people that we deal with. We have a lot of respect for each other, and we have a lot of fun with each other, and we are genuinely friends. All of those things made it an obvious choice for us to come to Japan as a group and create this incredible video diary of the work that we do to share with everybody that we know in Australia. I've travelled other places and never had a similar feeling of, of being in a place like Japan. You walk down a street of Tokyo and you can see such contrasts of individuals. You go to different parts of Japan, rural areas of Japan, where some of the factories are that we go to. The people there are very humble. It's a beautiful thing. It's something I think that we lose in Australia in a way. We sort of have a tendency to focus on ourselves and our own little world. You see a tile, you look at it in a way that perhaps is very two-dimensional. But to see this ancient art, the people watching will hopefully get an appreciation of the materials, the places, and the people that make these tiles. Generally, we come here to go to the factories, see what they're producing, see what combination of products we can work with to actually create something special for our own collection. It never ceases to amaze me. I've been here a number of times, and every time I come back, I see something else that just simply blows my mind. I feel like everything's a little bit more focused on the ceremony, you know, the way you eat and the way you greet people. And it's interesting, the different building materials that they use and where they use them and why they use them and the importance of how it's made, how that affects them culturally. One of the things that we find coming here to come to the factories is that the factories are in those small towns set into the typical Japanese landscape. Bring the Autodomus experts to Japan. We're going to have a fantastic look through architecture in Tokyo. We're going to visit a number of our factories. We're going to go to the Inax museums and ceramic labs and understand the ceramics that they make here. We can't wait to show everybody how Inax has become an incredibly strong part and an incredibly important part of what Autodomus is in Australia and around the world. Oh, 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 oh,